Hey guys, it's all Scott done Space Coast Day. I went to the boot fair this morning and acquired this for two pounds. An LL Boeing 777-200. Uh, like the United Airlines one I got, this is also looks like the one from the airline. You can see on there, I'll bring that in closer. You can, the markings there and everything. It's a different stand though, slightly different from the United one. But otherwise it's the same scale and everything, but yes, very happy to see this. And two quid, I mean, the the United one for five, it was a great bargain for two quid. I mean, yes, so let's bring that a bit closer. I actually saw one of their planes flying overhead today uh, out of Heathrow because I could see the blue. But I assume it was one of their uh, 787s. I think that's what they fly to London. But yes, very nice. Don't you see how the... The ribbon goes up there, and like I say, you see the underside there. So let's bring it a bit closer. You see the Star of David tail. Yeah, when you click head on, it's good detailing on the cockpit windows. Cockpit windows are something that they often get wrong on uh, model planes of all sizes. Yes, very nice. Very happy with this, as you can imagine. Another one for my fleet. I'll have to do an updated um, airline and fleet video at some point. Maybe do a comparison between this and the United 777. Not that there's any differences <laughs> whatsoever other than in the uh, stand here. But yeah, it's a two quid. Absolute bargain. Beautiful. So yes, that was quite the surprise there. You see the wings there. Point out. Yes, and you see this one back see the tail cone that's squared off but yeah very very happy with this completely unexpected to see that tell you what i did see um was um a model kit for a british airways trident um but it was one you'd have to glue together and paint and when i had a look in the box part of the fuselage i'd say this part was like snapped off and I don't even know if it was still in there or not. So I was like, uh, that's just too much trouble. If it had perhaps been in good condition, I would have considered it. But I haven't got time to glue one together or to paint it, put the decals on. That's why they make them like this. <laughs> Where you just have to put the wings and the engines and the tail and these together. And that could be difficult enough. <laughs> the most ambitious one I did re um, recently, of course, was that Imperial Shuttle Tidarium. When I assembled that, that took ages and that was complicated, but straightforward at the same time. So, yes, another Boeing 777 has been acquired for my fleet. An LL variant at this time. Like I said, absolutely delighted to pick this up for only £2. Please subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this content. Leave me a comment suggestion for a comment topic you'd like to see discussed or like the video.